Hi guys, it's me Audrey and I'm back with another video. Before we start this video, shout out to Dragon Cruisers. <laughs> Love that. But today for this video, I'm going to be showing y'all um, my order from Tarte I just got. I'm so happy. Okay, so the first thing I got is this cute makeup bag. It's really shiny. Ooh, yes. It's a flamingo. Love that. So the next thing that your girl got was Amazon Clay Waterproof Liner in white. So cute. The next thing I got was Rainforest of the Sea Radiant Drops. The packaging on all these is super cute as well. It's actually pretty big. And it just goes like this. And this is like a dropper. And next I got the Rainforest of the Sea Twinkle Stick. And I got this in pearl. Skylight I mean. But it's like there's like a pearl one and a gold one. Next thing I got was Shape Tape Foundation. And I got the hydrating one. My friend Maddie has the uh, matte one and it looks super good. So I picked it up but... Whenever I put matte stuff on my face, it looks really bad. So, we got hydrated, and I read some reviews, and apparently it's, like, not as good as matte, but that's okay. And it just comes with, like, a big doe foot applicator. Next, I got the mascara. Oh, my gosh, look how cute that is. Um, man eater. Look how cute this packaging is. Lastly, I picked up the Tarte lipstick and liner in the shade Sweet Pea. Again, super cute packaging. So let's jump into the tutorial. Okay, so I'm gonna try all these, but like I'm still gonna use my everyday stuff, so like don't hate on me for using stuff I didn't get. So first I'm using the L'Oreal Infallible Matte Lock Me Primer, which Totally contradicts what I said about not getting anything matte because it looks terrible on me, but you know, we got this. Also, before this, I moisturized my face with a H2O Tarte moisturizer or whatever that's called. So, I think what I'm gonna do first is go in with this um, Radiance Drops. This is gonna last like a long time because, like, you don't need a lot. So, it gives a really pretty sheen on the face. Yeah, that looks pretty. Or you can mix it in with your foundation. You can do that too. Next, I'm going to try in the shape tape. I think I'm going to ask for the Tarte Shape Tape um, Concealer. I've actually never even tried it. Like, there's not really Ulta's by me. So I tried it. Okay, hopefully, this is my shade. But actually, I think it matches me really well, but I don't know. Okay, so that's what it looks like on, um, I don't know. I really like it a lot. It gives, like, a really good finish to the skin, and I feel like it looks really natural, actually. Because I know, I don't like liquid foundations, because they never look, like, natural on me. But this one looks really nice on me. It doesn't cover as much as I wish it did, but I don't really care. Much. In my Maybelline concealers and concealing my face. I literally don't have under eyes. I don't think. So now that I have my foundation and everything on, I'm gonna try the um, Tarte Twinkle Stick. Okay, so I really like this twinkle stick. I thought I wasn't going to like it a lot, but like, it's super pretty. There's no glitter chunks. It's like just a nice sheet. Anybody talk about this? So next, I'm going to bronze my face. My favorite bronzer right now is a Too Faced Milk uh, Chocolate Soleil bronzer. Uh, pick yourself up one of these if you don't have it. I think it's better than the Hula bronzer. I have a Hula bronzer and like it always makes me look muddy. I'm literally going nowhere today. I have a cheer, so I'm gonna have to take this all off, but love that for me. We're just gonna put a little bit of opal on her. 
Okay, before we move into our last three products, I'm going to do my eyes now. Mm, so close to me. I'm going to do my eyebrows off camera just because... Okay, so I just did my eyebrows. <laughs> the only uh, Tarte product I have as an eyeshadow, because I was going to try to use like some of my Tarte products, you know, because this is like a Tarte kind of video. This is a Tarlet Tease palette. Here's what it looks like. I, whoa. I don't think I've ever used it before, so. Okay, so I hate blending this eyeshadow out. Um, if any of you girlies have a Tarte product that's like an eyeshadow, you guys should like message me or comment or something and tell me if it blends good because this palette blends terribly. Literally the worst. Okay, so I've never used white eyeliner, but I know a lot of people put like black eyeliner and then a strip of white eyeliner. Might try that. Or I'm thinking, should I just full out send it and just do white eyeliner? I think that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so this is where we're at on the white eyeliner. It's not really pigmented and I don't know how crazy it looks. Would the look look cuter without it? Probably. Is it adding anything to the look? That's good. No. Is it needed in this look? No. Uh, we're gonna put mascara on this one and see like if it's actually a look. Okay. Is this a look? I don't know. Mascara, um, it's like every other mascara. Is it better than a drugstore mascara? No, not really. I'm gonna do my outer eye like this and maybe it won't look so weird. Somebody tell me if this looks bad. Or don't, maybe not, don't tell me. Okay, so yeah, doing the other eye doesn't help this look. Um. <laughs> It's not the cutest look. Next, I'm going to try this thing. We're going to try this boy. And hopefully it won't upset us. So I like the color of this. Oh. This look from far away looks cute. Okay. So anyways, that's my uh, video. <laughs> Stay tuned for next week. Hopefully I'll make one next week. Lately I've been doing that. But um, hope you guys enjoy this.